The previous video about pooling raised a question. When should I optimize my code? First, what is optimization? It's the process of making your code more efficient, making it run faster. In games, we do this so that the game runs smoothly on our target devices. So when should you optimize? Well, in a case like this, where the game runs so slow that you can't properly test the game on your development machine. Then there's the case where you are past pre-production. You know that the gameplay is not going to change, but the game doesn't run smoothly on some hardware you want to support. It might be the Nintendo Switch, the game console, or some lower end computers. Once you have solid foundations, it's a good time to look into making things run smoothly for as many players as possible. This is not to say that during development you shouldn't pay attention to performance at all, just that you shouldn't invest a lot of time into optimizing things that could change later. Here's an example of why you shouldn't do too much optimization work too early. We wanted to make a roguelite with Godot, a free and open source demo to which you could contribute. And we wanted to make the game fairly fun and somewhat original. We've made this demo with designer Pixel Boy. Honestly, we could have pushed this as a demo, it's fine, but when we had other people test it, clearly it wasn't original enough. We leaned a little too much on making the game easy to play, and as a result, it lacks a bit of fun. We wanted to do better, but for that, we had to throw everything away. Now we have this completely different system, which is procedural, where you can have gems that modify the behavior of your weapon during gameplay, and the code for it is completely different from the previous shooting system, so optimizing it will also be quite different. We didn't have frame rate issues on our test machines, and if we had optimized the code to run on very low-end computers before playtesting, this work would have gone to waste. So that's why you don't want to do a lot of optimization work early. On this channel, we answer your questions about Godot and game development in less than five minutes. Be sure to subscribe and turn on the bell for more. I'll see you in the next one.